Hello everyone, this is Dominic Daughtry with Sunt Construction and I am here to give an instructional video on how to set up your Bluebeam Studio session and project uh, notification settings. So uh, first thing, you want to go over to your right hand tab and you want to go to the, your studio and you want to hit settings and when you hit settings from within the studio it's going to take you to preferences and it's going to take you to the studio tab and what you want to click on is the notification preferences and this will automatically open up and it will take you to the studio notification preferences menu and as you can see right here you've got account preferences and you've got four choices and we're going to go over those really quickly um, the first one is the one that I suggest every single user uh, uh, subscribe to as far as account preferences and it send me a daily digest of all session and project project activity and what that does is every single studio session or project it will give you one single email at the end of the day and it will tell you all session and project documents that were added or removed session user status changes session markup activity session markup status changes it will give you project documents that were edited and it will basically keep you up to date with one single email at the end of the day it's a great way to stay on top of everything happening especially if you have multiple projects multiple studio sessions a uh, great way to stay organized and uh, manage manage your activities the second one uh, specifically for the cal state uh, san bernardino uh, project uh, is send me an email with markup alerts for all sessions and what this does is markup alerts indicate that a session attendee has notified you about a markup that requires your timely attention and this is very important for the workflows that we set up for the Cal State San Bernardino project because this is how we're going to notify different team members uh, in our collaborative workflows that things need their attention whether it's an RFI is ready for review or it's finalized and ready you know to be distributed so you definitely want to have the first two checked. The third one is also extremely important for the workflows that we put together for Cal State San Bernardino is send me an email with an active session is updated. Session update emails include the following information when documents are added or removed and when user updates their user status. And these are all extremely important because these are the ways we're going to communicate collaboratively, co collaboratively on this project. Uh, and the very last one, although not specifically uh, uh, necessary for the Cal State San Bernardino project and workflows that we're uh, doing. It is uh, very helpful uh, if you want to keep up to date throughout the day uh, on what's going on within the studio project. It gives you uh, an email when documents are added or removed and when documents are checked in with changes. And you will get that information on the daily digest, and that's the only reason I say it's not specifically uh, uh, required or necessary uh, on the workflows that we set up for this project. So uh, below those, you want to press apply, and then below the below those settings, uh, they've got session and project subscriptions. And this is uh, all the sessions that you've either started or are currently attending and, and it's also uh, projects and attended projects and you can see right here CSU San Bernardino RFI review I want to make sure I apply all of those preferences specifically to that session so I'm going to press apply and that is it I hope you enjoyed the video uh, thank you